Hey y'all, welcome back to TMP TV. I'm Tracy. And it's your boy Bezo. And today we got a new edition. It's all about my girl. A beautiful addition to the family. So, we got a new addition to the family, man. If y'all been keeping up with our vlog, Miss, y'all noticed that we did not post yesterday. And the day before that, we told y'all I was in labor. And uh, it turns out I was. Yeah, <laughs> come to find out she actually was in labor. So, for those who think that was a clickbait, it, it was really meant. It wasn't. It, it was meant to be, but it really wasn't. So, it wasn't really meant to be a clickbait. Like, I was in early labor, but. Yeah. I had been in early labor for like a week straight, mm -hmm. but it had never been that long, like consistently long. Right. And then the times had never been that close together. Right. So I just kept joking with Brandon, like, all right, we're going to the gym. We might be going to the hospital. To, oh, yeah, that the was the day next. I wanted to go play basketball, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it sure was. So, and by yeah. the end of the night, so we're just going to pretty much tell y'all the whole, like, story time I guess yeah. and then we will be doing a birth and vlog Brandon film literally everything but I that's going to take so long to yeah. edit and I'm telling y'all I got onto my every nook and cranny <laughs> onto my every last bit of it I try to get it man <laughs> just because just so I can have it and just so y'all can you know see what's going on and stuff right so how it started pretty much like 5.30 on the 6th yeah, 5.30 early that morning. Yeah, I was, I started having contractions. Was that I, the weekend? I'm not even sure. It had to be the week. Yeah, it had to, yeah, it was the weekend. It was like Saturday morning. She started having contractions. Mm -hmm. Saturday morning. So, I didn't even say nothing to Brandon. I just like let it rock because I felt like, I don't know, I was already discouraged. Like, this ain't it. Like, it's probably just the same thing. It's been. Mind you, she already, like, what, 41 weeks? Yeah, I gave birth to her 41 weeks and five days. So, almost like two days shy of being 42, 42 weeks, weeks yeah. where they was going to take her. And I was just like, oh my gosh, I do not want her, them to take her because one of the doctors was like, well, if we take her because you're not really dialing any, um, you probably going to have a C section. And I was like, oh my God, I don't want that. So. I was going through contractions all that morning, and then um, when he woke up, I told him, but I was, I don't know, I was just like toughing it out, because I felt like it wasn't nothing, like it was going to stop. I just kept telling myself, it's going to stop. No couch, she's a soldier. I ain't got to <laughs> give it to her, boy. She's a soldier. What she went through, definitely a soldier. I couldn't have done it at all. No man. Y'all female, women in general, more power to you. Man. <laughs> <laughs> For real. So, we went to, I think we told y'all we was going to my mom's house to eat because they was grilling out. So, the whole time we there just talking and I'm still having contractions. Like, they getting more and more intense. Mm -hmm. But I'm just like, I don't know. Like, in my head, I was still like, even though I've been contracting the whole day, it still ain't it. Matter of fact, was, no, it couldn't have been the day we pranked your mama, right? No, it wasn't. Okay, okay. Because you was like, um, telling me. To go to the hospital or something, or did I want to? Or no, you was like, you want to stay here and then see, mm -hmm. and she could bring us the food. And I was like, no, nah, I'll just go because right, right, right. maybe if I walk it out, she'll come. But it's still in the back of my head, I was like, she ain't coming. So, um, Jeffrey got to be. Jeffrey got to be my head. Yeah. Yeah, I was contracting or whatever. So then, probably around like 10 30, it got to a point where I was like, okay, Unbearable. it really ain't stopped. And I was going to just be like, I'm still not going, but I was like, because I'm so far, uh -oh. because I'm so far um, past due, I didn't want like her to be in distress or nothing. So I was like, oh, we can go ahead and go. But still, I was like, they're gonna see me home. Right, and this whole time, <laughs> my mind y'all from the, I think the other video we did, she's still like one centimeter. Yes, dilated. one centimeter. So, when we get up to the doctor, I have been one centimeter for like since I was like 38 weeks. Yeah, for real, for real. So when we get up to the doctor, um, you know they, uh, cause she was supposed to get induced what Tuesday. Mhm. Mm so I mean, we went what Sunday. Mhm. Mm yeah, we went we went Sunday and um, Sunday night. Yeah, we went Sunday night, and when she went in there, you know she was having contractions. They did this thing. But we were still joking. 
We yeah, was like, we, show. as y'all can see in the video, like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, we were supposed, supposed to post the first ball. Like, we was like, okay, we're gonna do, they're gonna do a little check. We're gonna, they're gonna send us home. Nothing serious, you know. Man, when I tell y'all, we thought we was gonna be home, like, by like, at the latest, like, 10 o'clock. We stayed there basically all night. We didn't leave. When we got there Sunday, we didn't leave. So, but the girl was like, she was like, well, just in case you are in labor, because that's how I was on the one centimeter. And then when she checked me, she was like, well, I'm going to check again in an hour because they could see, like, that I was having consistent contractions. contractions. Yeah. And um, so they checked again, and then she was like, well, I'm going to come back in 30 minutes. And then by that time, I was four centimeters, and I just kept looking at Brenda like, and every single time you would call his mama like, they said she's two centimeters, they said she's three centimeters. Yeah, that was, yeah, that was crazy. That was crazy. <laughs> And then my mom was like, like they had already been saying like, yeah, she gonna go into labor and it's gonna be quick. Yeah. And I'm just like, yeah, right. And this whole time she, yeah, and this whole time she, um, you know, she she planned on going natural. You know, she was like, she going natural, she going natural. They asked her, did she, you know, did she want to and stuff like that, how she wanted to do it. And I feel like they was really, not playing me, but just like underestimating because I'm so small and stuff. Yeah, so yeah. I'm five was... feet and 125. So wet. <laughs> and everybody was just like, I don't know, they kept, I feel like they kept trying to low key pressure, pressure you, yeah. into, or pressure me into an epidural. Right. So. So, yeah. Uh, uh, yeah, so you know what I'm saying? The day go on, with the night go on, and she uh, steady, steady, steady um, dilating. Mm -hmm. And so, let and me tell y'all something I ain't room. never seen. They take this little plastic thing, which I know all the females know oh, about. Oh, I didn't. Me that way before. Oh, bro, bro, they take this little plastic thing, like it's like, let's say, like this is a top part, this is the bottom part, but it open like this, but it start out like this. So they put it in Tracy Dog and they started cranking it <laughs> like that. They opened up their holes. Wow. <laughs> I was like, what the? Fuck? Oh, I thought that door was open. Oh, man, I was like, what in the world? I'm looking in that thing like I'm like, what going on? <laughs> I said, what? The lady. Yeah. So she, you know, she she examining, looking around. She, I think did she get a cotton swab? I don't know. I, see. I think she got a cotton swab and um, damn. Different thing, y'all. <laughs> yeah. So I I don't know. I didn't see that part, but I do know that's like right before they came to check me again to see what my um birth plan was. Jeffrey, no. What my birth plan was and to see if I had dilated anymore, right? Yeah. So, by that point, I think I was like five centimeters. Yeah, five, five, and five centimeters. It took probably like, I don't know, say early that morning. By early that morning, I was seven centimeters. Right. And then, like, the, the contractions were getting worse and worse, more intense, but I was thugging it. They kept asking, you sure you don't want an epidural? You sure you wanna, don't want an epidural? Because when you get seven centimeters, we ain't gonna get you no epidural. You sure you don't want to? So, but I just knew like, y'all, I have a needle phobia, like real bad. And I would pass out to the smallest of needles. So, oh I my like, God, what about when they took your blood? Bro, they took Oh this, yeah, it was so much. Bro, they, they took this girl's the blood. First, like, the first lady who could not get my vein. It was about two of them first ladies. <laughs> it was about, man, it was about two on that really. And then she oh. said, like, oh, I'm so horrible. Like, you a whole like, nurse. You what operating is... on this lady. Like, you what operating on her. On? Like, and you over here, like, not even trying to console her. Like, you know, you know, we got this. It's good. It's good. No. She's just like, oh, gosh. She, you know what she kept, like, just poking the needle or the catheter in. And catheter, I, she was yeah. like, I can't get the catheter in. And I'm like, well, stop. And have somebody else do it. Yeah, so another lady had came in and, and just right stopped. Now. So another lady had came in and did it right away, but the, the crazy thing about it was, bro, I want to say they did at least eight tubes of blood, and tubes was like probably like this long, and they had to fill them all the way up. And I just had to, and I was going through contractions still. Yes. And I'm just like staring at Brandon. See. And then the lady kept telling me, like that she was missing the artery, and I'm like, oh yeah. my gosh, I, I don't terrible. even like for people to tell me, like See. I had to get blood drawn. Don't even tell me when you about to stick me, when you almost done. Don't tell me nothing. Just do it and get it over with. Right. But, um, yeah, so anyway, back to what I, 
was saying I got like seven centimeters and then pretty much stayed at seven centimeters and I wouldn't progress. And so they was like, well, we're going to have to give you the Pitocin, Damn. which I didn't want that either. But because that, if you don't know, like it basically intensifies your contractions and makes them shorter, but closer together. together yeah. So that you go ahead and um, dilate to 10 centimeters. So it was like, we'll have to give you the Pitocin. And I was like, uh -uh. so they came back like an hour later and yeah, I basically had to get a Pitocin. So then that at that point they was like, are you sure you don't want the epidural? Cause this is the last time. And I think they was asking that cause I was like No, you had screaming. already took the Pitocin though, right? Yes, but Bruh. before I took the Pitocin, before I got the Pitocin, <laughs> I was already like, Yeah, uh, yeah like, bro. Like, Animal mode. Bro, let me. I got video, so <laughs> <laughs> I got it all. So don't worry about it. Down, down. Oh, man. So, what do we? Oh yeah, okay. So she took the pitocin, bro. When I tell y'all about around like after the first thirty minutes, it was one contraction that hit her, and like is they got the, like the EKG. Is that what it's called? The I don't know. Whatever it's like thing you know, wave check, that yeah, check your, your contractions. Yeah, your contractions, your heart rate. So you can look at it and it'll tell you like when her contractions about to start. And I'm talking about one went up like this and it flatlined. So it was like giving her hell for a little second. But she she got that she got in the uh, little contraction or whatever you want to call it. She said, please. She said, uh, can I can I get the epidural now? Please, please. <laughs> Why you by this point? It's too late. It's too late. It's too late. I said, train. Ain't gonna turn it back. I said, it's over with, baby. <laughs> It's over with. It's over with. You gotta take that. I do remember that part. I was like, "Ready to bleed, ready to bleed." I said, "It's over with." Time. It's a mental thing from here on out. Yeah, you was like, "It's mind over matter." I was like, "I don't want to hear that." It's a mental thing. You gotta be physically strong right about now. Oh my god! And it's so, so funny, like hearing other people's stories. Like everybody was pretty much discouraging me, saying like, "Ain't no way you gonna do it naturally." And I did this, and I every single person who said they tried to do it natural was saying they was boohoo crying. I didn't shed one She didn't tear. cry at all. Not I one time. I was like, I ain't got time to cry. I'm in pain. She didn't cry at all. Not one time, which was which was cool. She did she. <laughs> um, so, yeah, so, you know, she... she uh, they couldn't give me the epidural by the line. They couldn't give her the epidural. But I'm glad, because I didn't want... That's not what I wanted. I was just... The pain was talking. Yeah. Because so, when I tell you, ain't no... I've never felt pain as bad as labor. Undescribable. Me. Yeah. So, um, you know, past the Pitocin stage, you know, well, I think the Pitocin was still going through the whole birth, right? Yeah, I think they cut it off right at the end, like when I was about to, when we was waiting on the, um, the doctor. doctor to come in. Yeah. So, yeah, you know, she had, she, um, she got done, well, you know, as the doctor was coming in and stuff like that. So, let's go ahead and fast forward to the, on the table. You don't want to just show them that part? Okay, okay, I'll show y'all. We're going to show y'all that part of verb vlog because it was funny. Even though I only pushed for nine minutes. Yeah. Well, no, she, was she did a natural birth with Pitocin and had a baby in nine minutes. So, um, but, yeah. Um, and this is the bundle of joy we got out of it. So we let y'all see, you know, the product yeah. of, you know, just our right lungs, now, fruits of our labor. Because she's always going to be yeah, so yeah, we just want that time to ourselves, but you know, we still, you know, we ain't being selfish. But yes, someone's being okay. selfish. <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm saying? We just want to enjoy our time with our baby right oh, now. Let's and, see. Uh, you know, still be um, interactive with y'all. So, that's why we didn't post the vlog this day. She had seven. to get that in there. No, eight. We posted day seven because. No, we didn't post seven. Post yes, we did because you posted the reaction video. I, I had given birth, and when I was in the background, and Brandon was like, They're doing checkups, I had already had the baby. Yeah, she already had the baby. She was in the room, like, you know, they was, you know, monitoring her after. after. Yeah. And I think Finish was gone at the time, too, getting her. She was getting her bath. Yeah, she was getting her bath. Her last assessment. Which it took her like four hours to get her bath because oh two my other. Gosh. No, it was it was because it two, wasn't their fault. Yeah. Thing. When it, as soon as as it was time to get her bath, like two other ladies in another room were like having their babies at the same time, so like everybody had to drop everything, and it was like an all hands on deck type thing. Yeah. So um Which you is know, fine. yeah. But um yeah, you know we got our little bundle of joy. The whole experience, like minus the pain, it really was enjoyable. Enjoy, yeah. Our amazing. nurses was nice. Our doctors was nice. Yeah. Everybody was like, 
extremely helpful. And then one lady told we needed, they did. One lady told Tracy Mama she can record, like and she Brandon had that th I told and I'm the one who told you I said yeah. you have to put it right there. Yeah, and I You put it right there. I put it right there, but even if I it didn't matter. You weren't going. What? I was not going. Hell no. Your mama wasn't going either though, cause she, cause she was on Facetime with my mama, and she, the reason that's why she said it, cause she seen Tracy mama on Facetime with my mama, and she told her like, you know, ain't no recording nothing like that. So Tracy mama was just like, oh, okay, oh, whatever, you know what I'm saying? Just like this, bro. And they both were still recording. Right. <laughs> the lady, the Tracy mama was like this, and Tracy was getting from there. Was like, oh man, are you recording? She's like, oh no, I'm, I'm on Facetime with her mother. I'm on Facetime with, uh, with my mother, and yeah, it was just. And I look, as she did that, I look back at the camera like. Man, I look at my. I'm talking about for real. Phoenix. Phoenix Capri Hudson. Oh, man. We're going to get on him. Jeffrey and another topic, bro. This, yeah. He's shot. Next shocked. video, we'll tell y'all about Jeffrey. He's shot. Oh, we'll tell y'all about him when we post the dog me baby for the first time. Oh, yeah. He's shot. That's, we did record his reaction. She okay, you know what I'm saying? She didn't get injured or nothing oh, like that. Oh, yeah. No. We just strictly talking about Jeffrey. He is. He, Weird. <laughs> Smash that like button for congratulations. Yes. I want to appreciate everybody for all the thoughts and prayers that we gave. That we, we gave. gave. <laughs> that I gave birth safely. And um And naturally. And we was out by the next day. Oh yeah. She only gotta stay stay in the little monitor area for one day because she was healing up very fast and the baby was healthy. <laughs> And it's crazy, bro. I got so much to say about this girl. It's crazy because it's Phoenix. Um, I ain't never seen anything. I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, I'm talking about like, she came out. I don't know if it was because she was 42 weeks already or whatnot, but holding up her head damn near on her own already, I eyes wide open, <laughs> like facial, you know what I'm saying, expressions, all that. Like, she, she already like loving life right now. So, and she sleep like a grown man. She sleep like a bear. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Like it's crazy. That's why if y'all like we loud or something, she don't hear it. Yeah. Yeah. Bro, I'm talking about Tracy can be holding her up and her like her arms be like this. But and when she go to sleep, bro, she'll do like this. Boom. And them bitches them bitches <laughs> fall with that like this. She be like this the whole time. It'd be so funny. Ooh, her farts. Oh my god. Oh my god. Bro, I'm, just, really? I'm just enjoying every moment of it if y'all can't tell, but it's crazy to me. I love it. Oh, but um yeah. That's our video for today, y'all. We're gonna catch y'all in Vlogmas Day. What is today's day? Teen. Vlogmas Day Teen. Alright. 